The North Atlantic Treaty Organization NATO is concerned that Russia may use chemical weapons in a false flag attack in Ukraine. The alliance's chief Jens Stoltenberg said on Tuesday. He was speaking at the press conference at NATO headquarters. Stoltenberg said, "We are concerned that Moscow could stage a false flag operation, possibly including chemical weapons in Ukraine. Any support to Russia military or any other type of support will actually show how pressure conducts a brutal war against in Ukraine and help them to continue to rage war which is causing death, suffering and enormous amount of destruction," he added. All of this sends an unmistakable message. An attack on an ally will be met with a decisive response from the whole alliance. Russia's invasion of Ukraine and its military integration with Belarus create a new security reality on the European continent. So we need to reset our military posture for this new reality. Tomorrow, ministers will start an important discussion on concrete measures to reinforce our security for the longer term in all domains, he added. NATO leaders will meet in Brussels on March 24th to discuss Russia's invasion of Ukraine, the alliance's chief wrote on Twitter. I have convened an extraordinary summit on 24th March at NATO headquarters. NATO General Secretary Jens Stoltenberg wrote, "We will address Russia's invasion of Ukraine, our support for Ukraine and further strengthening NATO's deterrence and defense. At this critical time, North America and Europe must continue to stand together." NATO's main purpose is to guarantee the freedom and security of its members through political and military means according to NATO's website. News desk Comedy Global.